Hey guys, hope everybody's having a great day today. Hope you've been safe during some of this crazy weather that we're having. Um, it seems like every year when it gets th this time, about this week of January is when we usually get this kind of weather. Hope you've been safe. Uh, and hope that your family's also been safe from COVID and any other illnesses. Anyway, guys, today we want to continue in Matthew chapter 5. Today we're going to read verses 46 through 48. And it says this, For if you love those who love you, what reward do you have? Do not even tax collectors do the same? If you greet only your brothers, what more are you than others? Do not even Gentiles do the same? Therefore, you are to be perfect as your heavenly Father is perfect. Now, we've read this passage before. And basically what Jesus is saying is it's easy to love the people that are nice to you. It's easy to want to go up and approach and speak to those people that you have a good relationship with uh, or that you know and you feel safe, you trust these, these folks or in, in, in general terms. It's difficult for us to want to go up and even speak to people that we don't know or at times even... Um, be around someone that maybe we don't have a good relationship with. Or maybe we've had some issues with in the past. And he says, listen, if you're not able to do that, then you're not acting in the way that God would be pleasing to God. I mean, the last thing he says in verse 48, be perfect as your Father in heaven is perfect. Being perfect in this situation means i got to love someone unconditionally. Regardless of what they've said to me in the past, regardless of what they maybe have done, and that is not an easy thing. We talked about yesterday about you know uh, turning the other cheek and how you can respond to that. Listen, um, sometimes no one really has to slap us in the face. Sometimes just a look is enough to just set us off, or uh, something that you know. And we'll talk about this Sunday, but maybe it's a misunderstanding, and we're not sure. We need to ask another question to make sure that we understand that. Point is, we need to treat everyone with mercy and grace as, as as best as we can. If we're not able to do that, step back, remove ourselves from the situation, spend some time in prayer until we are able to do that. Anyway, guys, listen, I hope this helps. Show someone some mercy and grace today that maybe you don't even think they deserve it. But aren't you glad that, that God gives us that mercy and grace? Anyway, have a great day. God bless you. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.